Well, once again, we are experiencing another reminder that it's still winter in Wisconsin. <laughs> Looking live outside downtown Milwaukee, and it's been a sort of like a wintry wet mix most of the day. Snow started falling in some spots, a little rain. Let's go to John Milan for all the details. After last year's summer-like March, I think we all we were all spoiled. We yeah. think March is in winter, but really March is a very wintry month, and spring doesn't officially start till next Wednesday. So. Guess we're going to have to endure with more snow and cold for the upcoming weekend. Let's start out with what happened today. We were in the 30s again, 38 degrees, rain or snow at times. Should be in the low 40s, the morning low at 29 degrees, averaging around 27. Now, we got three hundredths of an inch of liquid precipitation, but only a trace of snow out at the airport. March snowfall at 5.3 inches, and since February 1st alone, 30.6 inches, under 12 inches, before that. Now overnight tonight we could see some snow return one to two inches to our north an inch or less everywhere else. Let's start by checking out Doppler radar and what we're looking at is just a light rain or snow and sleet mix. Very light though from Racine all the way back through Burlington and Racine County and just a couple little patches of leftover snow showers across southern Waukesha County and northern Racine County rain around Kenosha. We're watching though an area of snow starting to push into Fond du Lac County uh, from the north and west and another area of snow north of the low that could roll in here probably after midnight tonight. But again, accumulations will be very low. Temperatures right around 33 in Milwaukee. Look at the 35 in Racine, 34 in Kenosha, 34 also in Whitewater, Watertown, and Beaver Dam. Uh, we're going to stay in the low 30s through the evening hours, and then temperatures drop off late tonight. 25 Milwaukee, 26 in Racine, Waukesha, and Watertown, 23, dropping all the way down to 20 in Fond du Lac. So you can see on our computer models a little bit of light snow still indicated through the overnight hours as this low pressure system moves through. High pressure then rolls in for the weekend. Still a few flurries possible on Saturday. That low pressure system hits Monday to our south. We'll get a rain snow mix once again. 32 in Milwaukee tomorrow. A few flurries around often on clouds and sunshine. More sunshine on Sunday and with an easterly wind we should see temperatures in the low 30s once again. So a cold weekend ahead, light snow at times tonight. A bit of a break in the evening hours, but coming back a little bit later on, 25, your overnight low, less than an inch, Milwaukee and South. 32 tomorrow, mostly cloudy, cold, flurries, variable cloudiness actually, with tomorrow night dropping to 17 under partly cloudy skies and a little sunshine on Sunday and a cold high of 33 degrees. Here's your storm team four. Seven day planner on Monday, back up to 35 with again a chance for a rain or snow mix. And right through the first day of spring and into Thursday, we're in the low to mid 30s, maybe 40 by Friday. If it hits 40 on Friday, that will be the warmest temperature wow. of spring, hmm. which will only be two days old. <laughs> well, we're looking forward to it. Cold weekend ahead. Yeah. Thanks, John.